you know, there's this narrative in Oakland, and you know, Oakland is a city of protest, of social justice movement. There's a narrative that capitalism is bad, is evil, and yet capitalism is run by human beings. And I believe that human beings are intrinsically good um, when given the opportunity to act through their values. When we look at corporate citizenship, traditionally the model has been pretty limited. It's philanthropy, we're asking companies to write a check to our favorite charity, or it's like a company-run volunteer program. But what we are trying to do is kind of redefine corporate citizenship in Oakland and look for where do we share values? Where are our mutual needs? And so Uber, and this is, this is a success story, I mean, we talk to Uber about things that we think they need too. They need a future workforce. And frankly, I think we've all recognized that tech will benefit from having a more diverse workforce, one that is also representative of its customer base. We have a lot of brilliant, very diverse kids in the city of Oakland. And so we invited, maybe that's a strong word, Uber to participate more strongly in creating that pipeline of future students to become their future workers. We also invited them to think about how they could participate in some non-traditional corporate citizenship ways, like thinking about their purchasing decisions. Um, and and I, I have actually a good success story to tell. Um, if there's one thing software engineers need, it's coffee, because it's a really boring job. We need our engineers. <laughs> I guess that hit home with a few people. <laughs> Well, any company is going to need to keep their software engineers caffeinated. <laughs> and so um, rather than just assuming Uber was going to contract with you know, whoever, we introduced them to a fantastic local bean roasting company in Oakland called Red Bay Coffee. Red Bay Coffee is, was started by an African-American entrepreneur. It is a workers' collective. And it employs almost exclusively formerly incarcerated workers. Uh, it is a really great business. And the good news is, its coffee is unbelievable. It's great. And so Uber, we introduced Uber to this great coffee company. They not only liked their coffee so much that they committed to use this coffee supplier in their Oakland office, they didn't want to wait. They entered into a contract right away to start supplying their two San Francisco buildings with Red Bay Coffee. That contract alone created 20 new jobs at Red Bay Coffee for formerly incarcerated workers. That is a win-win. That's awesome.